Good evening and thank you for joining us tonight at 10. At the top, a long weekend, crowded valley roads and highways, cartel money in the car next to you. Law enforcement says they are cracking down on criminal organizations using the holiday to move money south. They look for clues to intercept the cash. Channel 5's Catalina Cruz joins us with more on the plan that they have in place. Catalina. Identify, stop, and seize. Those are the three-step Operation United follows. It's a three-tiered approach of local, state, and federal law enforcement agencies paying close attention to all drivers on the road. Same people who commit crimes in San Nino, commit crimes in Harringen, commit crimes in Brownsville, affects us all. Criminals hit the road in larger numbers this time of year. They drive south, transporting wads of cash concealed in their vehicle. Has the carpet been pulled up? Are the screws missing? Are the screws have markings on them? Local, state, and federal law enforcement agencies know criminals' tricks. They use the old, old cars because they know eh, nobody, nothing's going to happen. They don't, they're not going to check me. Again, we do have what is known as sniffer dogs, which they come in handy and not able to detect any kind of narcotics and many times money. Operation United gives several local law enforcement agencies permission to patrol roads and highways outside their boundary. That's one of the reasons why we wanted to go beyond our jurisdiction and go outside of our city limits. And, a lot of that stuff, you know, it does affect our city. The three-tiered approach creates several barriers for the dirty money funneled south to be intercepted before it crosses our border. This is the final stop, the point where U.S. law enforcement ends. This is where we found traveler Alejandro Gutierrez. He doesn't mind the extra surveillance. It doesn't bother us because that's a routine. It's better to know we are protected, safe, and that our family will enjoy the holiday. It'll be a busy weekend. Law enforcement promises they'll be vigilant. You'll find the, the drugs or the money. So our roads aren't a corridor for criminal activity. Operation United will also be focused on cracking down on the transportation of illegal weapons and human smuggling this time of the year. Live in the studio, Carolina Cruz, Channel 5 News at 10. One more note to Carolina's story. We learned the money and property seized during this operation is used by local agencies. This is a Channel 5 News Extra. Vehicle seized are either used or sold for proceeds. The funds are used to pay for specialized training, new equipment, repairs on existing equipment, and supplemental items otherwise not allocated for in the budget.